Do your wheels kind of look all crappy? Like they look like flat white. And check it out. I wet sanded them a 2000 grit quickly. First I clean them. Now I'm just using a crappy old buffing pad. It's like 10 years old. The thing's terrible. Rubbing compound. And I'm getting a little bit of color back. Maybe with some wax. If I seal it up. It'll last a couple months. When a certain looks better than the other one. Got three more to do. All the edges gotta be done by hand. You can't get in there with a the buffer. That looks better. I got a little reflection back. Far away it looks great. Remember how it was all white? I'm doing this like so wrong. Paper towels, but again these wheels they got really have to be just stripped. In 24 hours these really might bleach back to that white color. I think wet sanding definitely helped get the surface uh, fade off. Looks alright though. Do the edges. See, I don't give a shit about these tires. You're gonna get that polish all over the rubber. But we made a video about these things a while ago. It's actually a guy in a, kind of far away. I thought he was closer. Has a set of wheels and like almost brand new Bridgestone tires. Uh, 2014 tires. So I think I'm gonna pass. Too old, but they're like they're brand new Bridgestones. He wants uh, about. 540. Look it up on Craigslist. You'll find it in Florida. Know where it is. It's far away from here. That looks cool. Other side. Looks better. Doesn't look like so much of an old piece of crap. Yeah, you see. You do this, you do that. Oh, I got this guy. And it comes right back to just coloredness so whatever it didn't work what I did find we're getting some rust 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 oh, rust it's pretty good over there right in that crack so I have to pick all that out and do something with that I think that corrosive water that you go through and like rust out your vehicle it must be all salty and you hit it more with the passenger side than the driver's side. Seems that way anyway. Yeah. There was this dumbass exhaust guy in New York. The guy who died here was way better. I should have had him fix that. But he didn't want him because it wasn't uh, rusted. But he put like a freaking extension pipe on here. So it's all rusted. He just cut that off and got like a stainless tip or something. Oh look too flashy but we'll get rid of that rust because I've treated it and it comes right back I don't know wheels eh a little better but what I've been doing too I'm gonna use the rest of that shitty pad I think to buff out these inner wheel wells on the bed they're real shitty use a little scotch bright tenor tree alcohol and it's cleaning them up pretty damn good you know that's obviously Scratching it up a little bit, but there's so much built on that. I'm not even getting close to the paint. This side is real bad. That's when these body shop idiots fixed this side like 15 years ago. It was all caved in over here. You see the bone though? It's terrible. It was all overspray over here. You still see a little bit over here. That's your spot that was rusty. We'll blend that in a little bit. A little etch primer. Over there it was rusty. I did a uh, acid etch primer. Then I put a little base coat on. Look at that, all the primer goop is coming off there. It'll come out good. A little clean up here and then. This turd looks a lot better. Mosquito. I got rust over here. I'm have to cut that out one day. Let's just get a junkyard piece. We'll get it. It always looks shitty when you look at it and then you start working on it and then it comes out pretty good. It makes you feel better. This wheel. So they come back, they get a little shitty faded looking again, but it's better than what it was.